Hey everybody, welcome back to Cave Story Plus! So in the last episode, we got the bad ending of the bad ending of the game. In this one, we will actually avoid that. Text appears on screen. Incubation successful. Who's over there? Oh, it's you. I didn't know if you were safe or not. I'm the only person here. After you took off to Sand Zone, we sped up preparations for securing an escape. It was then that misery showed up. Sue was taken away. And Professor Booster, he disappeared somewhere. The doctor has apparently acquired the flower seeds. But, I'm not blaming you. The doctor's victory was certain from the moment he acquired the demon crown. It's only a matter of time before the Mahismamiga army is ready to attack the surface. If that does happen, it'll be futile to try to defeat the doctor. Even for you. You have no choice but to run from this place. Anyway, an escape is possible, but only by using a flying dragon. That's why I came here all on my own for the flying dragon that I need hatched safely. Wanna escape with me? No. I see. Truth be told, there's one way you could change the Mamega back to their original state. Destroy the island's core. But the island may collapse if you do destroy the core. It is, is it too dangerous a choice for you to make? Either way, I don't know where I to find the core. If you really want to try and do it, I'll wait for you. But I may need to flee the island at any time if it gets too dangerous for me. Seriously, this music is some of the most beautiful in the game. Aw, how cute! Grrr. If you're looking for the cord, then you really need to hurry up. Alright, so if you've got the booster, we can fly down here. Uh oh. You were never seen again. Want to retry? Yes. Probably should have saved after I listened to that long dialogue. Whoops. Let's try this again, shall we? Well, that failed. Alright, this time I'm actually going to save that I went through all that dialogue. Sweet. Ah! Darn it! The booster is harder to control than you might think. Hey, what the heck? I saved! There! Jeez, it's not that hard! The Little House. Every little in the world can find the Little House. Who are you? Where'd that husband of mine go? Have you seen my husband? So, it's a tiny family in here. Okay. Alright. Time to put an end to that doctor. Who would have thought an enemy who was a, who, like a big bad guy who was a doctor would be so intimidating? Whoa, hi. The clock room. We get the 290 counter. If you... Oh, something is inscribed on the counter. This I present to you, the challenger, in anticipation of your determination. Show me your best. If you uh, are not en route to get, if you are not en route to get the golden ending, you actually can't open that chest. Also, that clock like kinda has a purpose. Ooh. 
So at this point in the game, oh yeah, those guys are back. Oh shoot. Never smile at a crocodile. Whoa. Okay. Oh, okay. And... Spur! Yeah! Fully charged spur is basically a one-hit kill for any enemy in the game. Or can deal with massive damage to bosses. Either way, score. Take that. See how great the spur is? Oh boy, yes. Oh! Eek! Don't kill me! I'm a human! I was turned into a Mimiga by magic! Huh? You mean you're not a ro killer robot? You startled me pretty badly by coming in so suddenly, and you're pointing a gun right at me. Are you here to save us? Yes, I am. I'm Ito. I'm one of the humans who came to study the island. Misery gave me this lovely new Mimiga appearance. I could probably run away, but take a look at me and I, how I am now. I'm stuck! You must have climbed all the way up the wall from outside. I'm quite a capable engineer, but I also have an innate fear of heights. Ugh. I shouldn't have come to a, a place like this, Floating Island. Yeah, that's probably a mistake. Yes, I want to save. And hey, it's the main menu music! Might seem out of place for a world like this. Passage? I'm sure you're wondering how in the world can we get to the door down there? Well, long story. Statue chamber. Halder. Anachupon. Miyakido. And apparently he's sculpting the doctor. Okay. Doom, 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 doom. I forgot there were actually enemies in here. This is basically Mimiga Village 2. Careful with the spitting gunfish! Note, they can be used as steps. Cool. Take that. Whoa! That sparkly normally means there's an item there, but there's no way to get that without dying. The doctor from the surface is using the Mimiga of this island to grow red flowers for him. Similar kinds of events have occurred in the past, too. Who are you? Curly does not remember who we are. Uh-oh. Perfect. Hi, dude. Mimiga aren't talking. It's gushing water at a furious rate. Okay, those little plant guys are a lot tougher than you might think. Rest area? It's the fisherman! Yo, haven't we met somewhere before? Must have been in Mimiga Village. That witch misery brought me here. I really dislike farming. 
Gonna go clear my head with some fishing for a little bit. Do you like to fish? If there's another chance, maybe I'll bump into you again? Man, these Mimigar just are not talking to me. Not a bad robot. I'm a good robot. It's gushing water at a furious rate. The sprinkler is... Oops! I can't be talking to humans. Well, that's just... Oh, they're growing the red flowers. Jail number two? I haven't been to jail number one. The doctor can eat it! Oh, you're a killer robot? You've come to kill us? Nope. Do you know a Sakamoto person? She should be hiding in the plantation somewhere. Really? There were a few humans in here as well, but I haven't seen them recently. I wonder if they escaped safely. Hmm, teleporter. Yeah, I want to teleport. Hey, hey, hey! We remember this area. Can I only teleport to the plantation, though? Because I missed something in the labyrinth. I was literally right next to it at one point. Yes. Life capsule. Only plus four. Take that. Here's jail number one. What's the password? I don't know the password. We'll be coming there a bit later. Alright, there was a place I could go through here. Not for there. No, it's not there. There's a there is a door I can go through somewhere. Oh boy. Hi. Where is this place I need to go? I think there's another teleporter around here somewhere. Oh, it's probably through here, that's right. Oh, it's you. I caught something strange. You can take it if you want. It's inside the bucket. Peek inside the bucket. Inspecting carefully, you can see an item of some sh kind shining within. 
We get the teleporter room key. Yeah. There we go. Use the teleporter room key. Yes, here we go. Teleport to Arthur's house? Yep. I found you, killer robot! That was a pretty nice trap, I must admit. Maybe if he hid somewhere, though. Hey! Hey, you! Are you dead or something? Mmm, gulp. Oh, you're awake. I thought you were already dead. Sue would smack you and you wouldn't move an inch. This place is a jail. Those who oppose the doctor are locked up in here. I'd to be used as text subjects for his ongoing experiments. Sue said so. You a friend of hers? You're a little bit too late. She was here as well. She worried about you so much. It was only a few minutes ago that she was carried off. Uh-oh. And by the way, she snuck something in your pocket while she was taken away. Really? Sue's letter. Yeah, I want to read it. Hey, it's me, Sue. I don't remember telling you anything about us. We came to the island as a research group. It was me, my mom, Kazuma, Professor Booster, and a few assistants. The doctor was with us, too. He was supposed to take care of our medical needs, and he did, I guess. But all that changed when he found the demon crown. The crown used to belong to the master of this island, and grants immense magical powers to the person who dons it. The doctor knew about it well before coming to the island. It's the reason he forced himself onto our group. And he grabbed hold of the crown, and that was pretty much it. We couldn't do anything about it. The only thing we could do was continue the research of the island under his command. He seeks to rule the surface using the island as a flying fortress. From what I can tell, he plans on attacking the surface with the enraged Mimiga army. I was able to escape, however. The other researchers are probably... Of course, he's using the innocent Mimiga to grow a large quantity of the red flowers. And once he's ready to attack, he's gonna send the Mimiga into a state of insane rage by feeding them red flowers. With his powers from the crown, he'll control them and me too. If you can get out of the jail, please look for a hidden safe house somewhere within the plantation. If my mom is still alive, then she'll be there working on a plan of her own to beat the doctor. Please get help her as much as you can. Before I forget, the password to get into the ho safe house is Cave Story Backwards. That's it. Wanna read it again? Nope. Nope. Well, interesting. Yeah, I'm gonna save, and that's where we're gonna leave the episode here. Thanks for watching, I'm Colorful Artie. In the next episode, we'll escape from this jail. Have a great day, and God bless.